Okay, I love the raspberry. Well, I like raspberries, but I also love the color because red, I'm all about the red. And that is just such a beautiful, I guess magenta, beautiful red. Anyway, why am I sticking my arm into this, whatever this bush is, very, very. So today is Monday in the first week of Advent. And our reading is from uh, Leviticus 19. And it's basically, it's uh, God telling Moses the laws. And he said, and I, after each one, he says, I am the Lord your God. But he talks about that you shouldn't lie. It's not the traditional commandments we're used to. You shouldn't lie. You shouldn't cheat your worker. You shouldn't... Um, uh, lie, what was it? Lie, steal, uh, defraud someone. What I found interesting with this one that made me laugh was you shouldn't curse a deaf person, deaf, deaf person, not deaf person, a deaf person, and you shouldn't put a stumbling block for the blind. And I'm thinking to myself, was this such an issue with the people of Moses' day that they went around behind deaf people and cursed them? And they went around when they saw a blind person and threw blocks in front of them, so they tripped. Was that really, really such a, was that such a problem at that time? Uh, anyway, it made me laugh. Um, let's see, the Psalm, I believe is Psalm 19. And I believe, I don't remember what it was. But the Gospel, I believe, is Matthew 25. Uh, 31 to 46, I think. And, oh boy, what is it starting to sleep now? It uh, talks about ah, the goats and the sheep being divided. When Jesus comes, he's going to divide the goats from the sheep. And the goats, the sheep are the ones who fed the hungry and clothed the naked and uh housed the homeless while the, that's the sheep, while the goats are going to be the ones who didn't do that. And the, each group will ask, Lord, when the ones going to heaven, the sheep will say, Lord, when did we, because they didn't see Jesus. They didn't actually house and feed Jesus. They housed and fed those who were misfortunate in their midst, those in front of them. Who do you, who do you take care of? The person right in front of you. We can't necessarily always feed the, the hungry of the world, but we can certainly feed the person on the corner. Get a hamburger when you get to McDonald's to get your McFlurry, your Mc, McNutty, whatever it is. You can grab a hamburger for the guy out on the corner or the lady out on the corner who's asking for money. And so, um, what I also found interesting here, I was thinking dividing the sheep and the goats. So the sheep are the lucky ones, but if you're dividing sheep from goats, uh, presumably you're going to eat both of them. And now I would rather eat the sheep because lamb, you know, is, is darn good. Uh, so that doesn't seem like a good thing, but it. I always was wondering about that. Okay, well, so... You're the lucky ones who get the, the sheep get to die and be tasty while the goats are a little less so. I mean, goat is fine, I'm sure, if you're used to eating goat. But I haven't eaten goat. Maybe I did once. But uh, anyway, but then it occurred to me today, sheep, so the, Jesus dividing them up, those are going to go to heaven and those are going to go to hell. Those are going to live and those are going to die. It occurs to me one of the main things people do with sheep is shear them. Uh, I didn't look this up. This came out of my little brain all by myself, if this is right. So I, maybe the sheep are going to be sent to another direction and get sheared and live. Now, eventually you're going to eat them because, like I said, sheep are just a little too tasty. I guess when that sheep gets to be 112 and no longer shooting out any, any good wool, that's when you probably eat them, but whatever, or 12, whatever age a goat sheep gets when you eat them. 
But, uh, yeah, so maybe that's what it's all about. The sheep go to one side because they're just going to be sheared and then they're going to live. So, uh, this is a Dog Walk Chronicles. Um, maybe you know what it's all about. And that's what it's all about. Okay. Have a happy lunch.